we have a staple gun with 3 8 3 8 inch 10 millimeter staples we also have a nail gun that we use one inch rad collated nails that are also 25 millimeters and then we like to use impact drills but it doesn't really matter what drill you use uh, just the drill with the Phillips head and a box cutter to open your box identify set up three things you look for your shelf and the other shelf you have the finished edge or two sizes you'll receive uh, some large L brackets. You may receive some smaller L brackets depending on the size of the cabinet. If it's a, a 36 inch cabinet, either wider, tall, or larger, those will be in there. You'll get some larger screws, smaller screws. These kind of hard to see with this camera, but they're rubber, rubber stoppers for the doors and shelf pegs. First thing we'll do is we'll put the rubber stoppers on and the L brackets on all four The next thing we're going to do is put the back of the cabinet, staple it down, put the big screws in the back of the cabinet to the top and bottom wood, and then your L brackets on the left side. Wider, they'll go to support the front frame, taking it to the side of the cabinet or the top of the cabinet. 